the vlog guys so today is a very exciting Aoife and I are going to see the Olivia Rodrigo concert in Seattle oh. <laughs> our cat is so excited about this <laughs> can you get out of the way please so we're just gonna be taking you through getting ready for the concert going to the concert all that good stuff so you can see all the good Olivia Rodrigo content that you deserve <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and Gracie Abrams um, is opening for our leg of the tour. Uh, Holly Humberstone is opening for the other legs. Okay, Nico's really into the vlog Nico today. Nico loves the vlog. Anyways, we'll see you when we're getting ready. Doing my makeup and I'm stressed. Power Stone palette. I don't know if you can see, but that's kind of what we're looking for. Look, working with for the eye look. Before. Just kidding. <laughs> Get ready. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. A little, a little cosplay moment, perhaps. She's also gonna have the stickers, but she doesn't have yeah. them yet. Okay, where are your, is everything from? Go. Um. So this top is from H and M. This skirt is from Forever Twenty One. These boots are from H and M, and these clips are from Megan's uh, drawer. A stealer. Before. Hello, mm. this is me. Where's everything from? This has from H&M. This top is from Eva. I think I got it for her off Etsy. Um, these pants are from Target and I cut them. And these boots are from H&M. Give oh, us a twirl. And I have a bracelet that says Gleek. Love it. The Give us a little twirl. Get it, yeah. The girls that get it, get it. The girls that don't, don't. Anyway, so we're about to leave for the concert. We're running a little bit late. Um, so we'll update you guys on the road, but yeah. Oh, and get my makeup. Oh yeah, let's get it on. Wow. <laughs> when she's an artist. <laughs> okay, we'll see you there. Hi vlog. We're on the road. Um, the reason why we're so like stressed about time was like, I wouldn't be this stressed if this was like a concert, you know, where you have like seats. seats Cause it's all general admission. So we're, you know, we're always already in the mindset. Like, obviously we're not the people that have been camping out there yeah. all night, all day or whatever. So we know we're not going to get, you know, up front or anything. Listen, we're scholars and we had to go to school. We had things we had to do. That's just life. That's how it is. But we're still very excited. We're still hoping, you know, the venue is pretty small. So I still think wherever we're at, we're at it's going to be a decent spot. We're going to the Wamu Theater in Seattle, Washington. That's the show that we are going to. I'm going to try and film as much as I can like of the process and everything in there so that you guys can see it and kind of see like what it's like and stuff. But yeah, that's pretty much the plan. We haven't eaten. Don't think there's gonna be time to no, eat. I'm so hungry. So, I was just thinking about how hungry I am. That's unfortunate, but you gotta power through yeah. for the concert. Yeah. Um, Maybe we'll be able to eat something outside. Cause that's yeah. the, oh, fun fact, Sounders game is also on tonight. There's also a Sounders game. It's gonna be a whole thing. It's gonna so, be a whole process. they have hot dogs outside the venue. And so. you know, that's life. Like we live and we learn. What song are you the most excited for? I am most excited for Favorite Crime. Um, Favorite Crime is my favorite on the album. I love the album so much. Like, I love every song, but literally something about Favorite Crime just does it for me, it just does it for me. What song are you most excited about? I'm most excited for... I mean, obviously, like, I think they're gonna go crazy with Good For You, mm -hmm. but I'm most excited to see Jealousy, Jealousy. Yeah. Yeah, also Gracie Abrams is opening and I love her when and she I'm performs. Less, I'm less familiar with yeah. her, so that'll be cool for me to see her live as kind of like my first overall experience with her. Oh my god. Yeah, I think um the lighting I'm so sorry, it keeps like turning white. Um uh on our way here on our drive, I think I'm gonna play a song or two for Megan just to familiarize her with because someone did post this set list on TikTok last night. Um, I don't know if it's gonna be the exact same. Like, I heard that she's singing Complicated by Avril Lavigne. Don't know if that's gonna be a current thing. I'm sure it is, but, um, but yeah. I'm really excited for Gracie Abrams to perform because I love her um, a lot too. So, yeah. Cause I have to wear a mask. Like, we have to wear masks, by the way. Um, so I'm not really gonna put them, like, too low. Um, because no one will see it. 
so. Uh, but the show goes on. But it was my wedding day. It'll look more normal when there's more. This is a complicated process. Does that look? Oh my god, I think that might look weird. Okay, guys. Sorry again. The lighting is really annoying. But this is what I have. So I have my butterfly, these random just like dots, a lot of flowers. I put a good for you one here, um, cause I needed another big one. It has like a lot of small ones on the pack. I pretty much used like all the stickers. One of them fell. Oh, oh my God, I just found it. It's on my freaking jacket. But I don't think I need it, um, cause I have a lot already. Um, but yeah, the flower is cute. My favorite one's the smiley face and I put it in the same spot as her on the album. Such fan behavior. I love these little moments we have. Megan was upset because we haven't had moments like I this. I was not upset, I was just commenting. She was upset. Well, I was upset too. Like when I realized we hadn't spoken too much um, lately. Anyways, comment down below what your favorite Olivia Rodrigo song is. Also, if you guys are here randomly watching the video, I don't know if, if they're like just random people watching the video to see like what we wore to the concert. I don't know why they'd be listening to this part, but um, what date are you guys going to and are you excited to go? Anyways, okay, bye. We made it. Just barely. My god. Yeah, there happens to be a Sounders game on the same exact night at the same exact time. I don't know who, like, scheduled that, allowed that. It certainly wasn't me. A man is yelling out his truck asking who's performing. I'm like, hungry. look at us, it's I'm Olivia. Hungry. A girl just came up to me and said she pointed and she said you're hot as fuck thanks girl i mean i was there too but, but she said it to me she well she it. tapped me on the shoulder she too, pointed but. at me yeah at she me also face. said to me the line's finally We're moving. moving it's the concert it's starts in 30 time. minutes it's go time we're still hungry sing along but you can't um but you can you know if you if you catch on like saying why not right uh the song is called block me out and i wrote it um i wrote it uh the lyrics are pretty specific but i wrote it when i was really upset with my anxiety and kind of um <clears throat> just felt like i was losing to it sort of uh but then that's why we write that's why we write so that, <laughs> so that we don't lose <laughs> This is that, this is, this is uh, blocking out. Gracie killed it, she was so good. She was so good. She was. Now we wait.
so much for coming. Is everyone drinking water? This next song is by someone I love. She is the pop punk princess. She's complicated. have one question for you guys. Seattle, do you guys ever get deja vu? <laughs> Concert thoughts. My I don't know if you can hear it. Yeah, um, I'm in pain. Pain? That was glory. Such a good um, it was beautiful. concert. You thought, I see it's such a good confetti hold on. What? So it's a like lobby bar. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it was in the shape of a butterfly. It's in the shape of a butterfly. There was confetti. Well, we made it out of the concert alive. It was freaking mm -hmm. crazy. It was so good. It was wildly good. Now we're desperately trying to find food to fill our stomachs. And you know what? We will give a full recap tomorrow. Yeah, we're tie-tie. We're tie-tie. But yeah, so see you tomorrow for a recap. It's the next day. And we thought we'd give a little recap of the night and what went down. Yeah. Um, the concert was really, really good. So good. We had a very good time. It was about how I think long? It was two it? hours. Two hours. Yeah. They said the doors would open at seven, but they really opened at like seven thirty. Honestly, it was like almost seven forty. I think yeah. before we got it. We, because everyone was standing there, and we were all like, "Why are? Why is no one moving?" A few of us like walked up to the front occasionally just to like check, and it, like no one was moving. Stand still. But once everyone got moving, it went really fast, and oh they God, actually yeah. ended up starting like on time, which yeah. was crazy. No, that was one thing I actually really appreciated was it started like right at eight, or maybe like a few minutes after eight. Like it really, it started when it needed to. The way they had it set up at our theater, there was like bleachers in the back, and then in front was just like. A mob of people in yeah. the pit and so we were down in the on the floor and it was very crowded it was very stressful very crowded. <laughs> um, it was. that part was not enjoyable it was painful and hurt there were but like worth it it was worth it there were a few people that passed out and we had to like make way yeah. for security but 
the security was really good and they handled it well. When it happened during the set, like Gracie, like mid song was like, hey, somebody go help that person. Yeah. She handled it like super Yeah, well. they all handled like, it very well. Um, also, I thought Gracie Abrams was such like, she was amazing. Like I've, I, I've always known I liked Gracie Abrams. She's a really good songwriter and artist, but like last night, like hearing her live, that was, she's phenomenal. Yes, like, she phenomenal. was very good. I'm not as familiar with her and I I enjoyed her more live. Like I thought she was just really really good live. She was a really good mm -hmm. performer and stuff. So she was yeah. really good. And she connected with the crowd a lot. Like I yeah, felt she like was we were like waving. like I felt like She's we were friends. Like we were friends. And then Olivia came out and it started with brutal and it was like crazy. Oh just they like kept like vamping it like Doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> oh and before that they played olivia by one direction yeah and we were like it's starting it's yeah starting. also i want to say gracie's set i think was about 40 minutes and yeah. olivia's was probably like an hour and a half her band was incredible the set was amazing beautiful it was kind of we were talking about this it was kind of like a almost throwback vibe of like it felt like you were at like a 70s prom or yeah. something the way they had the set built it was like a box and it had these like cool like um, tinsel uh, streamers yeah, yeah. Um, going down, and the lighting was beautiful, I, purples was and pinks and reds and yeah. smoke and yeah, it was just really pretty. There was this moment when the mirror ball like they lit it up like super intensely. There's like this giant mirror ball, mm -hmm. but yeah, it was incredible. So she played all of her songs off the album. She mashed up one step forward and, and enough for you. Enough for you. And then she also played Complicated by Avril Lavigne, which was incredible. Mm -hmm. And then Seether. Seether? I cannot remember who that's by. A song called Seether. We can't remember the band, but she she killed it. And I've heard that song, like, by the artist. So sorry. No disrespect to the artist, but Olivia is way better. Her version was, like, so good. It's it was really good. It was really good. So we did not, we were not able to, like, get to any merch. Sorry, I didn't, like, show you a ton of that. But because everything was general admission, there just like wasn't a good opportunity to go. Yeah. And then at the end, everybody went for the merch table, and so the line was just like incredibly long. Yeah. But I can like find a picture of like what a lot of the merch looked like. <laughs> Nelson, please. And I can like put that here. But yeah, they had like shirts, sweatshirts, uh, mm -hmm. sweatpants, hats. There, there was, was a, a tiara, tiara. <laughs> socks, stuff like that. So. If that's you know something you're interested in, there are they do have it. I would recommend probably going to. I'm pretty sure there was a merch table outside, yeah, and I'm that would sure. probably be a better route to go because once you're inside, it's just super chaotic and like there's not gonna be like a super good opportunity to go. Mm -hmm. But yeah, ten out of ten experience. It was pretty crazy. It was mm -hmm. so much fun to sing the songs live yeah. and like see her in person. She just didn't seem real. She no. looked like a cartoon character come to life. Or also, something. Olivia, if you're watching this, drop your hair care routine because we so all need true. to know. So I think true. she genuinely has like the prettiest hair ever. Yeah. So drop that routine, girl. So if you liked this video, leave a like, comment down below, and let us know if you're going to one of her concerts or in what your favorite song is. And I put out a new video every Monday, so look out for those. I'll see you guys next week. Have a good summer. Bye! Bye. <laughs> Red lights, stop signs. I still see your face. Get it? <laughs>